What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we are in my favorite local park. I'm going to be doing some Pokemon Go stuff now. Uh, for those of you that haven't been following, I am moving soon so this may be one of our last videos in this park. So enjoy it and appreciate it because this is one of the best parks I think in Daejeon and it's also really close to where I live. So um, yeah, anyways, today we are gonna be talking about the new adventure incense that we are going to be getting daily uh, in Pokemon Go. Now this is a brand new thing. They didn't really tell us that this was coming. It literally came out today. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna kind of go through that today and uh, I'll show you what you can get. There are some really, really cool things that you are able to get off of this incense so um yeah i hope you guys are ready so let's do it okay guys so this brand new adventure one day incense thing is going to be available every single day for free it is going to kind of just be similar to kind of i guess the daily gift box in the shop where you can only get one uh it's not going to be like incense where you can stack like maybe one or two of them if you use if you haven't used one then you can use it the next day i don't think it's going to be like that and they've kind of said it's not going to be like that but uh i'm going to try and put up some pictures of basically what it looks like when you open up the app the very first time and you see this uh you basically just have to go in and claim it so what's going to happen after you claim it uh essentially on the top right corner basically above kind of or below where the weather is uh above if you have a mega evolved pokemon or your own personal incense there's going to be a special blue one it's not in your inventory it's not anywhere else that's where it is this incense is only good for 15 minutes and i've already posted in my discord the kind of pokemon that are spawning off of it as well as information about the three secret pokemon that we didn't know about um well I kind of knew about because there have been some leaks uh, over the past few weeks regarding these Pokemon. They are Galarian Articuno, Galarian Zapdos, and Galarian Moltres. So yes, we have some new variants, not the Hisuian forms, which I think is a little bit strange because this is the Hisui event that this is starting in, but we have Galarian form legendaries. This is this is new. This is a new thing and I like it, all right? They look amazing and I'm super excited to try and catch them. The downside is they are a super duper low catch rate. Like it's really, really low. It's like a 1% chance or a 0, 0.0 something percent chance. I don't know the exact number. There was some information in the leaks about it, but yeah, you're going to want to use Ultra Balls and also to use Golden Raspberries if you do encounter one of these Pokemon. And as of right now, I believe they are not in raids. They are only available as catching from the 15 minute incense. You got 15 minutes every day to try and find one of these guys. So I'm going to go ahead and activate my incense now and I'm gonna walk around the park here. And yeah, we're gonna try and find one. Um, hopefully I get lucky. Not everybody is, so I'm hoping that I can get some park luck. Uh, I'm actually gonna turn off my Go Plus so that way it doesn't screw anything up because that would be really, really bad. Um, my recommendation to you guys is if you do use a catcher or a go plus, definitely don't try to do that to get one of these guys. Cause like I said, the catching chance is so low. You're probably not going to get it, especially with a regular Pokeball and no berries. So yeah, anyways, let's go ahead and click on this incense. So as you can see here, it says special incense with a mysterious fragrance that attracts wild Pokemon to your location as you move for 15 minutes. So that's why I need to walk around the park. Uh, you can receive one each day at no cost. I assume eventually it's going to be a paid thing as well because it says one day or once a day at no cost. Again, here we go, Niantic going with the money here. So let's go ahead and use it now and uh, only one type of incense or mystery box can be used at a time. Okay, never mind. We gotta wait 13 more minutes for mine to run out. So I guess uh, I will be back in 13 minutes. Okay guys, so what I've decided to do is I'm actually gonna activate the incense when I get on the bus because I have heard that it is not working very well if you are not like very strongly and actively moving forward. So we're gonna, we're gonna go test this out. I'm gonna turn it on as soon as I get on the bus and uh, hopefully we get some good Pokemon. I'm gonna record all of it so that way you guys can see pretty much the whole 15 minutes. Uh, and I guess wish me luck, hopefully we get something good. And hopefully if we get one of the Galarian legendaries, they don't run from us because yeah, the, the, the run rate is apparently very high. So I guess, uh, yeah, let's go hop on the bus and uh, I'm gonna say goodbye to the park. This is again, probably one of the last times that I will be here. Uh, so I hope you guys have enjoyed all the videos that do have this park and uh, let's go get on the bus!
Okay guys, so we have made it home and as you just watched, uh, we went ahead and we did our incense and I didn't get anything good. Um, well, I, I can't exactly say that. Uh, I didn't get any of the legendaries, the Galarian version of legendaries, but I did get a pretty decent Pokemon and I'm gonna go ahead and show that to you now. Uh, I think it'll be something that will surprise you guys because I wasn't expecting to get this out of uh, the Pokemon that we caught. But uh, yeah, anyways, there there is our, our four star right here. It is a four star. It was an Aaron, but I evolved it during uh, the, the, the spotlight hour tonight. Uh, so yeah, there is our four star Aaron and I actually forgot to put a star on it and favored it, which is a bad thing because I could have actually transferred that out because I the only Pokemon I usually don't transfer out are the ones that are starred. So yeah, that could have been real bad real fast. Anyways, um, this is my second one. So I'm not like super crazy about it. It, it is what it is. Um, it's a great Pokemon to have. But uh, you know, I would have preferred one of those Galarian legendaries because obviously that's what I was going after. And in typical Mr. Korea fashion, do I get what I want? No, 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 I definitely do not. Anyways, um, yeah, so basically my take on the event, here's, here's my number one tip. Number one tip, you need to make sure that when you drop that 15 minute incense that you can walk around. If you can't walk around, don't do it and wait because the spawn time, if you're just sitting still is like five minutes. So if you are not moving, you're only gonna get like three Pokemon. Now, I will also just really quick show you the research page that comes up after that. Uh, and I'll the, kind of pop up the different research pages. It's it's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Now, the second research page is to use Six Daily Adventure Incense. So this is basically something that's gonna take you a week to finish. Obviously, today's the first incense. And then in order to get to the next page, you need to catch 10 Pokemon, which means you need to walk. Now, uh, again, also on the second page, you have used daily adventure incense to help you catch a hundred Pokemon. What I was seeing based off of other people's kind of postings and then my own experience because I think I got around 21 Pokemon or something like that. Uh, most people are getting around 20 to 26 Pokemon if they are walking. It does appear as if the Pokemon spawn about every 30 seconds if you are actively walking. Now if you have to stop and wait for a couple seconds you're not gonna get a new Pokemon to spawn in because again, it's only activated by walking uh, unless you sit still and then you'll get a Pokemon every five minutes and that's just absolutely awful. Thanks Niantic. Anyways, and then the last one is to walk 10 kilometers. Obviously they are trying to get us to walk. They are trying to get us out to, to do stuff. But again, it's a little bit frustrating because like we can't get the Pokemon any other way. We have a 15 minute window and clearly from my experience and then also from some other people, no, none, a few people I know have seen them. Nobody's been able to catch one because they run after the first ball. So if you do not catch it on the first ball, they run. Uh, but then myself and then a couple other people that I know I haven't even encountered any at all. So if you have been able to encounter one, let me know in the comments down below, did you catch it or did it run from you? If you were able to catch it, how were the stats? Were they any good? Uh, I think this is gonna be one of those ones where the chances of getting a good set of one are gonna be very low. So you might want to try to save them and trade them with your friends. That's gonna be my number two tip is, you're probably not gonna get the best stats, so save them. If you go lucky best friends with someone, then you can trade them with your friends. Uh, but really make sure that you're trying to get these every day because you can only use it once a day. It's 15 minutes. As of right now, you can't buy more of these special incense. So uh, I honestly feel like if this is something that they're planning on keeping around, they'll probably make it a pay to play kind of thing where you can pay for more uh, in order to get access to these Pokemon. But also they're 15 minutes and you have to walk. Like you have to be able to dedicate 15 minutes to walking in order to get these Pokemon. So yeah, anyways, uh, that is pretty much everything you need to know about the new Adventure Incense. Uh, let me know in the comments down below what you think of it, uh, if you got anything good off of it. I was surprised to get a hundo. I usually don't get anything good off of incense. So yeah, you know, I'll, I'll take it. I, I guess you got to take your wins when you can. Uh, if you haven't noticed, my, uh, my office behind me is starting to look a little bit different. I am officially moving next week, so do be prepared. Lots of crazy things to come, lots of new updates. So if you enjoyed this one, make sure you drop a like and let me know in the comments below what you think of this new feature in Pokemon Go. And I guess I will catch you all in the next one.